You are now watching the It's Reese Live. You feel We've never seen Steve Wilk. We've never seen Steve Wilco. Let's see this drip. So your cousin and her boyfriend were on the show last week, and you became an issue. Did you know they were coming to the show? Yes. Did you know that you were going to become an issue in the story? No. You didn't know? No. He brought up this bathroom incident between you and him. He uh, made that whole situation up. So he never was in the bathroom alone? No, we were him. never in the bathroom. I don't even know what's the part one. We missed it. We missed the initial story. Who this lady? He just doesn't like me, and he just tried Why doesn't he like you? I honestly don't know why he don't like me. Do you ever get in arguments with him? No, I no. never did once. Well, so why do you think he's saying that he had an encounter with you? Plus, yeah. he said on the show that you have a bunch of pictures of him shirtless what? on your phone. Yeah, that never happened either. He took my phone. He asked me to t use my phone. I said, okay. I didn't think of anything of it. He left. He came back and took my cousin into the bedroom. I was like, oh, your cousin's got all these photos of me. First off, why are you in my photos? Huh? You got to click the app in an iPhone. Why are you looking through my photos? Right. Um, so he purposely took my phone, went on his Facebook, and screenshotted the photos and then told her I did that. And then that's when he brought up the, um, I told him to come in the bathroom and have sex with me. So Whoa! Then my cousin comes out of the room and starts yelling, freaking out, telling me to leave her house. So I leave because I didn't want to fight her. And have you ever before? Um, yeah, one time. <laughs> Can I ask why? <laughs> it was over something petty. Like, she just hit me with a spatula in my face. And then I just she hit you with a spatula in your face? <laughs> yes. So then Did I, it have like pancake batter on we, it? She was, cooking, she was cooking eggs. eggs. <laughs> so, then, so when she cracks in the face with a spatula, what do you do? I look at her like, what? And then I drop her. And I'm on top of her. Just you keep, dropped her? How'd you drop like, her? Like, grabbed her. Oh, dropped you, her on the you floor, yanked her down. Then I went on top of her and just kept punching her in the face. And then my cousin grabs my arm. And then that's when she clawed me. And I was like, you stupid bitch. Per yeah, stupid bitch. And I punched her in her face. Oh! Don't scratch me. And I punched her in her face. <laughs> What kind of family is this? So, did you eat the eggs? No. No. <laughs> oh, I know what it was over. It was over dishes. She was telling me to do something. I was like, you're not my father or my mother. And I went upstairs. She wanted you to clean the dishes. Yeah, she wanted me to take the dishes out. And it wasn't my turn. It was her turn. Were you guys living together? Yeah. Yeah. And how you, you and your cousin get along now? We, d we don't because we of don't. Josh. Oh, because of Josh. Mm -hmm. oh. Has he ever hit on you? Flirted with you? Well, two weeks ago, there was an incident. Um, we were all drinking. My cousin's barfing in the bathroom. <laughs> he tells me to come in the kitchen with him, and so I listen to him. He then, said so casually, like, well, you know, she was out looking at the flowers. No, she, <laughs> she was in the bathroom barfing. <laughs> <laughs> and then he Ew, Steve ugly ass. He Stop me. focusing on him. I suppose. Yeah. Okay. We were talking about the show, about coming, and he was like, why don't you just tell your cousin that you did say all those things? And I was like, Josh, I didn't. And I'm not going to say something that I didn't do. And then he t comes closer, like moves up closer, and was like, I'm going to tell you something. I was like, what? He's like, I had fantasies about you. Oh, and I was like, wow. Why, why don't you get up and get, go in the bathroom and tell my cousin what you just said? And he's like, no, 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 I can't. I was like, I was like OK, Josh, say no more. Wait till we go to the show, because that's a question that's going to be asked, too. So what do you hope happens today? Josh, at the end of the day, stops making up rumors about people and lies. And I hope that my cousin, after seeing this and knows that I'm telling the truth, that she leaves him. Steve. This, this is your Josh. third time now hitting the yeah. stage. We can't get rid of you. Um, <laughs> but now, you were on the show initially because you said that you had slept with your stepmother. Mm -hmm. Turns out, and you carried that lie for like six years. Yeah. Turns out that was a lie. Then what? Uh, you failed the lie detector test for cheating on your girlfriend, but you believed that the test wasn't narrow enough in the dates. Um, you came back the following week and you couldn't come on stage because you were sick, right? So now, and now you're back again because uh, you said that she took your phone, took a bunch of pictures of you, topless, um, and you said that she came on to you, right, in the bathroom. Tell me that story again. All right, look, Steve. I'm not gonna sit here and beat around the bush. I don't like this girl whatsoever. She's a prostitute. I don't like. Oh my, my goodness! Girl will never chill with a prostitute in her life. Chew with what? My girl doesn't chill with prostitutes and never will. What does so that you, mean? I ain't no after, prostitute. So you, you shut your mouth right there. You are a prostitute. No, I'm not. You are. He tries to create an altercation between me. And All right, now her own.
Why would what you is go going on? I don't, I don't talk to this girl. I never no, went in the bathroom you, with her. I never did nothing you said with she this came girl. Up to you in the bathroom. That, no, that was that was never said. I never said that to my girl. That was never said. None. Of you is coming said out that of her she came. True. You came out to her. No. That she came out to you. No. You didn't say you that. You said that. I said that she had pictures of me on her phone. That's it. Right. I never. She never tried. I never tried to have sex with so her. So you never said None that, that I tried to bring you into the bathroom. You're saying that oh, never no, happened, Josh. No. Uh-oh, what's oh, happening? What, are you on, what about the story that she just told about your girlfriend is... That's all lies, man. Like, I gotta finish. All right. <laughs> your girlfriend is in the bathroom throwing up in the toilet, and you tell her, I've had sexual fantasies about you. That's a complete lie. This girl no. lies about everything. Yeah. What is her purpose? And that's why my girl doesn't chill with you. That's why you lied about your stepmother. Oh, you about say. Sex with your stepmother. You say you want to okay, gain a relationship with my cousin. You don't chill with your cousin. What? Okay. You never will. You never beat. Yeah, because you never beat her up. Because you. You never beat, you. Her, up. You you never beat her up. I was watching that. You never beat her up. She beat yeah, you in. Yes, she beat you in. Because you ate What is going on? Yeah. Right. And what did she get sick from now? She's just sick. She's, she's got a just stomach. She's just sick. You go back to the same sushi place, yeah. did you? No. Okay. Yeah, she's sick from life. I hear you. Take them both back. Okay, so your cousin is not feeling well. Him and her, they get sick every time they come here. <laughs> and That's quite funny. honestly, we're, we're, we're we we coming we, around a prostitute. We want we want. Yeah. Oh my Catch goodness. We want. I make it clear for the viewers at home. Your name's Jaylen, and her name's Jaylen also. Yeah. So you're both Jaylens. <laughs> um, you weren't feeling well. I saw when I was coming in. You didn't look. You look much better now, by the way. Yeah. You feeling a little better? Yeah, I am feeling better. Okay. Um, she says she never took those pictures. That he did it. Right. He took the phone. The bathroom incident, which we were covering. Now he's. He's saying it never happened, Jay. Right. He's saying that the bathroom. I never told him to come to the bathroom. Remember, he said that. I know. That happened. He said that the other day. Yeah, he too, just said that. I never he did not remember saying that, so I don't know. But he did say that. Yeah, he did. He said it to me. me. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah, so who do, you, who do you believe in this situation? I don't know who to believe. It's been four years now. I mainly am believing my cousin right now. Right. Uh, we asked you, have you ever propositioned going Josh on? to have any sexual activity, contact, or intercourse? You answered no. Have you ever had any type of sexual activity with Joshua, contact, or intercourse? You answered no. Did Joshua put those pictures of himself on your phone? And you answered yes. Mm-hmm. About two weeks ago, did Joshua tell you that he had fantasies about you? And you answered yes. The results came back all the same to each question, and they came back that Jalen told the truth. <laughs> Joshua uh, is back for the third straight week, and we gave him a lie detector test last week. He was too sick. Um, we asked him, have you ever propositioned your girlfriend's cousin Jalen to have sexual activity with you? He answered no. Approximately two weeks ago, did you tell Jalen that you had fantasies about her? He answered no. Did you put those pictures of yourself on your girlfriend's cousin Jalen's phone? He answered no. The results came back all the same. All the question, same. And they came back that Joshua did not tell the truth. <laughs> oh. He's a compulsive liar. We know he was lying when they told us his stepmom he slept with and he was lying about that. Want, um, there's one more part. I'm done with I would you. like you to stay up for I'm done more. with no, you. I'm, I'm done with the show, Steve. I'm all set with this. Yeah, because okay. you told you well, lied. I'm all set with this. No, okay. I know. Okay. Joshua also made a confession. He stated they had sexual contact and intercourse with two other females besides Jalen. You, Jalen, mm -hmm. in the past four years, right? You made that confession? It was one, it wasn't two. It was supposed to say one. Okay, but, but you anyway, told your whole point of coming, it. your whole point of coming here, coming back, mm -hmm. was that he said he didn't cheat on you in the last four years, and he told Dan, he's saying one, Dan says he told him two that he cheated on you, but he did cheat on you in the past mm -hmm. four years. Okay. Then we went on to ask him after the confession, besides two females, during your four-year relationship with Jalen, have you had any other sexual physical contact with any other females? He answered no. He did not tell the truth. You've been making me seem crazy for all these yeah. years, yeah. huh? I know, I made you seem yeah, crazy. Yeah, you did! Well, I, I know. About so much I did I just scared you! I did I can't lie. believe I fed with you! All these did after lie. nothing! Dude, you cheated on me more than, yeah, more than once! Yeah, I know. Oh! 
That was to the face. Bang! Right on that cheek. Bang! Domestic violence. And he ain't playing no defense. He just there to put a hand on the belly. He just want to touch her stomach. Touch your hand. Make her stop smacking this man. Yeah, I know. Six times later, you were honest. Don't, okay. Six don't, times, don't, six don't times you cheated on me later, right? Why don't you calmly tell her what you feel, what, what you want? I, I told her. Tell from her the now. Beginning. Tell her now. You know, Steve, whatever. I made some mistakes in my life, all right? You're I not, didn't want her not, hanging out. Listen. I didn't want you hanging out with your cousin. I have yes. reasons why, okay? okay? When you were hanging out with your cousin, you got into prostituting. You your cousin's a prostitute. Okay? Yes, she did. No introduced her to yeah. and she became a yeah. prostitute because of you because of you look at this guy he started hitting the harlem shade you and she became a yeah. prostitute because of you because of you and you're a low-life loser i'm not a prostitute. a prostitute there's no proof i'm a prostitute, prostitute. so you need to shut your prostitute. mouth prostitute. Mm. Uh -oh. this is it go ahead i won't no, hit my girl don't do it don't do it i dare you yeah, good. I am leaving. See you later. Bye. 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 Loser. Okay. Good luck. Okay. Yeah. I would. I just bitch. suggest. I would both of you stay away from him and enjoy your lives, right? <laughs> right. Yeah. Do good things, right? And if you are doing something you shouldn't be doing, don't We're do not. it. Okay. He's good. Good luck to you. Steve handled that situation like a true goofy. Perfect. Chat. That was good work out of Steve. If I'm being honest. That dumbass situation. That man just a compulsive liar, and they're going to believe him and come on that show? Shit. Josh would swear on his parents' grave and be lying. That's something he would do, because that's all he good for is lying. His funky ass. That's all he good for. If Rosie Perez was from Boston, face ass, man. Mm-hmm.